Good morning, Amy here from Carson's Landing. Hope you're having a fabulous day. A little while ago, John and I had made a farmhouse dining room table, and I wanted to do a video including some of the footage from this because I think it's a great project that turned out really well. We went to Lowe's to pick up the wood, and we just went step by step. It was kind of trial and error as far as the stain colors and the process, but John had followed an Anna White plan and we had sanded it, then stained it, sanded it a couple times and tried some different stain finishes and we ended up with something that we really, really loved. So here is the final table in our dining room. And I really love how it turned out. You can see a lot of the scratches and nicks that I put into the table just by taking hammers and different tools and just nicking it up a little bit. I love how the color turned out in our dining room. It's not too brown and not too gray, but it still has a little bit of a muted hue. And I think it just looks great with the flooring and the lighting in there. Here's a close up of some of the nicks that we added to the table. And it just gives it a little bit more character. As you can see from the sheen, we also added a couple layers of the polyurethane to the top as well. As far as the legs go, we had painted it a dark gray, which was actually some paint that we had had for the accent wall in our family room. We already had the paint. So we had painted it a dark gray underneath so that when we sanded the white, you would see this beautiful dark gray color coming through. So as you can see, we put some nicks and scratches on the legs and the bottom um, just to make it look a little bit more worn and rustic. And here's a shot of our living room, dining room combination. Thanks so much for visiting us today. I hope you enjoyed seeing our new farmhouse table that we built. As always, have a wonderful day and we'll see you in the next video. Please like and subscribe. Thanks guys.